All right, folks, thanks for tuning in. Uh, today, we're doing a little bit of small game hunting, primarily going after some woodcock and grouse, maybe a rabbit or squirrel here and there. At the spot that I'm in, I usually uh, pick up a few grouse, or excuse me, a few woodcock here and there. So hopefully I kick up a couple. We had a front come through yesterday, maybe push a couple birds down and I'm going to hit a couple of these spots to see what, what pops up, so stay tuned. So far, no luck. Good habitat for them. What we'll cock like this edge cover. Especially in the close to some moist soil the other side is probably better other side of this this field uh, but I like to come in this way and work my way back on the other side better worked if I had a dog and a couple other hunters but sometimes I just like to come through here by myself and relax I kick up one good two three even better this is the kind of area that I gotta be careful for a lot of briars this is the area where they like to hide out kick up one or two and through here Make our way into this stuff here, along there. That's where I get most of my flushes when I'm hunting for woodcock in here. The old timber doodle. We'll be on alert. Gotta be on high alert through here. Oh yeah, the soil is starting to get a little softer in here. You got the woodcock, they have uh, long beaks. Oh, there's two. Gosh, I got caught off guard. Two right here. Oh my goodness. Well, I tell you, high alert. I had two birds right here at my feet, and I didn't even see them. Good news is, they went down. One flew that way, one went down right here. I'm going to try to make my way around. Woodcock, they don't fly very far. You can kick them up again. <laughs> Just talking about how they like this soft soil on my fit. I sat down and then two of them flushed up right here. Unbelievable, I walk right by them. Alright. Keep my eyes open. I'm gonna cut back around and see if I can't. I mean, literally right here. Kick up that one again. So, 
one went down right in here. Here somewhere. I don't know if I hit that one. Dang it. Yep, he went down right here. Missed him again. Yeah, he flew down that way. Man, these suckers are tricky. That's right where I saw him go down, right in here. And he flew out and went that way. I think I'm gonna cut around and try for that one one more time and then come back in here. Like clockwork. Stepped in that stuff. Saw the soil was soft and said this is the places where they like to be. And sure enough, two of them sitting on the ground right next to me and I didn't even see them. And they took off out of there. So that bird went in there, circled around. He should be right over here somewhere. So let me cut them cut around and go around that way. Then I'll come back and go through here again. Dang it, man, these suckers catch me off guard every time, right at my feet. I mean, he was literally sitting right there. back that way that's three times I kicked them up and didn't get them wow you are rusty Keith super super rusty so he's back over where I was wow Two birds, three flushes. Actually, one, two, three, four flushes. One bird flushed three times and I missed them. All three times. 
so. There's no sense in me cutting through that because I'm not going to be able to get a shot off if I do kick one up. Let's go back where it was. Finish up my, my little chomp through this area. Hopefully I kick up a couple more than I freaking hit. So, oh, there's two birds that way. I'm going to go in, circle around to my right, and then come back to hit that. I'm sure that there's two there. There's some more somewhere in here. Just kicked up another one. That one didn't sit tight. I didn't have a shot at that one. But I don't know where he went. Keep my eyes open because there may be another one. I got to be careful because there may be another one in here. Sitting tight. Start, stop, and stare. Make a quick John up this way, just to be certain. I need another one up here. Got that one. Yes, sir. I got that one. Careful because there may be another one. Yeah, I see blood. There he is. Yeah. Look how well they blend into these leaves. They blend in so good. So, yep, there's, there's a woodcock for you. They got really, really pretty colors. Uh, so, it was two birds in that last. One flew out early, and that one sat tight, and... Just like I thought, there might have been another one in there, and I just wanted to go up tight, and sure enough, there he was. 
So finally got one. And I'm about to lose some battery, so let me check out for a second. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six flushes, four birds, one down. Not very good shooting on my part or being ready on my part. That time I was ready. That time I was ready, even with the one that flushed off far in front of me. I had a feeling there was going to be a bird in here. That one, first one flushed out way out in front of me. I figured there's probably another one somewhere around. And I swung around and cut the edge of this stuff. And sure enough, he flew straight up in the air. And I got on him before he could make a move. So, I'm going to continue up here just a little bit further. See if there might be another. And then loop back down around where that last one that flushed out in front of me went. See if I can't get him up again. Alright folks, well there you have it. Uh, that's it for today's solo hunt for uh, Woodcock. Um, not a bad day. Uh, flushed four birds. Got one. Uh, should have had more, but uh, my shooting was a little off today. In any case, uh, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up. Uh, stay tuned for some more uh, videos coming up shortly.